This game has a lot of interesting imagery and um, it seems like they've actually done their research when it comes to a uh, certain uh, like cult-like things, I guess. It, it's just lighthearted enough, right? Because obviously cults are a very serious thing. Uh, you should always be aware of them, you know, of anybody trying to sell you anything, uh, even if it's not apparent to you right away. Like, just be careful. You know, because sometimes people don't have your best interests at heart, even if they say they do, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, just be careful. An upgrade? Oh yeah, give it to me please. Yeah, upgrade time. I'm gonna destroy everything that they wait, can I recycle? Oh, okay, cool. I like the little lights at the top. These little hanging down lights. <gasps> hey! Are we all but players in this game of chance? Yes. I love everything he says. Gain an extra half a life? Or your attack rate increased by 1.25%. You know what? The extra heart might be nice. Let's do that. Yep, all right. Wait, if I lose it, do I lose it forever? Or do I always have another half heart left? Uh-oh. Wait, someone's doing my job for me. I don't like that. No, wait. No. -uh. Let's shy. How can this be? You were put to the blade, lamb, as all your kind were, and yet here you stand before me, unrepentant. The crown, his power, could it be? But I am stronger still. Turn tail and run, little lamb. Nope. How dare you destroy all the things that I wanted to destroy? That is for me to destroy. Again, like I was saying, I don't know if I lose. I don't know if I lose the um, heart if I get hit, you know what I mean? Like if I get hit, is that it? Do I lose it for good? It's gone? Or is that gonna always be like a half heart there for me? You know what I mean? I don't know. Oh. Just a little shy. You've come far enough, little lamb. My followers are willing to do anything for me. Can you say the same of yours? Amducius. I give myself to the cause, O oh mighty lord. By the blood of the great ones, destroy the red crown. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh boy. Amducius. Understand. Oh, poor, poor fella. Oh. I'm so sad for Shalom them. Ba, Please spare me. Shalom ba, Convert me to your cult. I will follow your teachings faithfully. Ba. So cute. Ah. I will save them. Wait, do I have to choose? I don't know what this skull necklace does. Can I choose that? Follower will live unnaturally long life. Double what would usually be expected. Okay. Cool. Ooh, and I get. Ooh, I get the shiny coins. So that's that. We did it. We didn't kill the boss, but we killed their follower warrior. 
All right, we got one little notch on our thing up here. One notch. All right, let's return home and see how things are going. Nice. Oh, I didn't even take any damage from the boss. Okay, interesting. Uh, cool. I I guess I didn't get the question mark thing, so I guess I didn't do as good as I could have done. Um. Oh, wrong direction. I'm relieved to see you made it safely and you have not returned alone. You've convinced more to join our faithful flock. Let's indoctrinate this new convert so that we may continue. Alright, hello. Convert me to your cult. I will follow your teachings faithfully. Alright, I'm gonna just keep them all the way that they are. I can't change the variant on him. Uh oh. This sent faith when falling ill. Heals 15% faster when sick and in bed rest. Weird? Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just make him like this color pink? Alright. <laughs> go. Followers are either work or worship. Worshipping followers generate devotion for you to collect. To collect devotion, you require a shrine. Alright, I get it. Build a shrine. Your followers can now worship you. There is a new follower. Assign them to worship at the shrine. They collect the devotion your followers generate at the shrine to unlock divine inspiration. Oh, and we get a free follower out of this. Please spare me. What are their traits? Loose and faith and falling ill. When a follower is a sacrifice. Easier to level up. Okay. So far, we haven't been getting very good uh, heretics, but it's all right. Collect devotion from your shrine. Once you collect enough, you will unlock divine inspiration. The more followers worshiping at your shrine, the faster they will fill up. If the shrine is full, they will stop worshiping until it is emptied. Once you've collected divine inspiration, unlock new buildings for your cult through the shrine. Okay, cool. Alright, wait. Hearty meat broth. Oh! I'll just cook that. Uh, and then... Okay, cool! So we can actually cook many things. All at once! Yay! Okay. Let's try building... Can we build a farm? I do have some DLC stuff. Thank you, Tag Reina. Alright, so we got divine inspiration. Wait. Do we. Okay, so we need a temple for that. Where's the temple? I'm so confused. Where do I unlock this? Oh, it's the temple. Oh, okay. This is what I unlocked. I I was overcomplicating it. Sorry, y'all. Alright. Yay! We unlocked things. Farm plots or sleeping bags. Okay, we need more divine inspiration. 
But now we can build a temple. Oh wait, we need rocks. Okay, I need you. See this. Right, I can just get stone too. Like, I don't know why I'm waiting on them to do it when I could just do this. I could just do it myself. You know? Show them that can be done. Oh my gosh. Just giant. Alright, can I build it now? We're gonna build it right next to the food place. Right, it doesn't matter which direction it is. Actually, can we build it? We can actually build it here, I think, right? We can build it right next to... Yeah, let's build it right... Right here. Right next to the entrance. put it here actually I think I can I kind of like it next to the entrance to this area and then it's right next to the food place as well I was trying to build and instead I was talking to the follower I'm like no build the center of your cult. From there, you will preach sermons to grow stronger and perform rituals to mold the fragile minds of your followers. You are responsible for maintaining the faith of your cult. If it falls too low, your followers will dissent against you and eventually leave. Your followers are ready to hear your word. Show them that you are their great leader. Preach a sermon from within your temple. Former sermon, drawing energy from your followers to bolster the power of the red crown. Okay. Strength through the flock. Through the faith of your followers, you grow stronger. Performing sermons will draw power from them and allow you to unlock new abilities, weapons, and curses. Followers with a higher loyalty level will generate more devotion. Therefore, the more followers you have and the more loyal they are, the quicker you will gain new abilities. Hearts of the faithful. Permanently gain half heart. Okay, so here we go. This answers my question about earlier. You are amazing to behold, the natural leader. I see why you were chosen. You are to guide your cult. You will need to declare doctrines so that they might obey you. Return to the lands of the old faith and seek out commandments, stone fragments. With these, you will be able to declare new doctrines. 